Greetings everyone. Manupatra brings to you the news highlights of 1st February 2023. Starting with the Supreme Court. The Supreme Court has directed all courts and tribunals to frame guidelines in cases where amounts are deposited with the office or registry of the court or tribunal that such amounts should be mandatorily deposited in bank or financial institution to ensure that no loss is caused in future. The court has held that being short of sufficient funds to pay court fee is not a reason to condone delay in filing appeal and observed that an appeal can be filed in terms of section 149 of CPC and thereafter the defects can be removed by paying deficit court fees. Highlights from the union budget The income limit for rebate of income tax has been increased from Rs 5 lakhs to Rs 7 lakhs. Highest surcharge rate on income above Rs 5 crores is to be reduced from 37% to 25%. Extending benefits of standard deduction to new tax regime for salary class and pensioners. Increasing tax exemption limit to Rs 25 lakhs on leave encashment on retirement for non-governmental employees. Under Make AI in India, three specialized AI centers to be set up in educational institutes. The national data governance policy is to be introduced. Under Vivaad Se Vishwas, less stringent contract execution for MSMEs. Under Vivaad Se Vishwas, easy and standardized settlement scheme. Phase three of e-courts to be launched. Entity Digi Locker to be set up for use by business enterprises and charitable trusts. Setting up of National Financial Information Registry Setting up of a Central Data Processing Centre for faster handling of administrative work under Companies Act This concludes the news for today. Thank you so much.